Why do we do this? Why do we go to Germany for the best fired heater to heat glycol to provide the heat in the van and also provide the heat we need to heat hot water and to keep our, our tank, our fresh tank and our plumbing hot? Because it's an elegant solution. I mean, here's, here's the water heater as we looked at. The alternative to this water heater is to have a big hot water tank and to keep that hot water hot whether we need it or not. The alternative to diesel for firing to heat this uh, is to have propane. And that's another system. There are restrictions about uh, tunnels and other things with propane. Uh, a lot of our clients don't really want propane. Other reasons why we use diesel fired heat and very compact uh, high efficiency uh, heat exchangers is that it frees up space inside. We're everything we do, we think about how much space it's going to take, how much energy it's going to use, how can we use an existing system to provide something so we don't have to add another system. Uh, another thing that we do, well, just to mention that, that's how we get almost 40 equivalent carry on bags worth of cupboard space in a motorhome because we put things like the water heater under chassis, the furnace under chassis. And the other thing that does is it, it creates a clean, what our clients like to call stealth look. We don't have vents cut in the side. Uh, we don't have a vent for the refrigerator because we use a compressor refrigerator. We don't have vents for the uh, a propane furnace because we don't have a propane furnace. We have the uh, diesel furnace under carriage. So there are reasons we do this. It's, the reasons are simplicity, elegance, uh, uh, combining systems. That's what we do. We innovate, we test, we're engineers and technologies, but we're also artists and we really love the idea of a very clean, attractive vehicle.